hello guys welcome back in this video we'll just discuss what synchronized access so synchronized access will just go with a simple example like sales and sorry not sales so we'll go with the category first and add sales here and i'm going to create a line chart of this where is this line chart so for this you need to have date right sorry in the first place i'll take the ship date as the columns and i'll format this to month and year okay so right click um, custom and month and year so i got the date so to the left in the rows i'll add the sales Okay, so this is my line chart. So I'll make it fixed to width. Now here, I know there are sales, but sales are from zero to eleven thousand, and I'm going to add uh, the profit as well. So profit to the right. So here you can see this showing the com combination of profit and sales but when you look at the dual axis for example to the left axis if you see it is from 0 to 10,000 dollars uh, sorry 100,000 dollars and to the right it is from 0 to 16 dollars so profit is at, at the range of 0 to 16 dollars itself so if you do if you want to see how the ratio went uh, with this 0 to 100,000 dollars you can just right click here and click on the synchronize axis you can see the profit is in this way sorry the sales are in this way and your uh, profit is in this way like this so when you synchronize the axis you see the both uh, <coughs> what do you say both lines are with the same ax with the same with the single uh, axis here the left or you can make it this the right or the left so you could have clicked here and synchronize axis this could have synchronized with the left one okay so this is how you can do it uh, this is a simple example of a synchronized axis you can do this with a line chart as well with a bar and line chart I have tried this yeah so you go ahead and play with the canvas and the options you will have a good look at this thank you guys